Hello everyone, today I'm going to disassemble PlayStation 4 of first generation and I leave links to the PlayStation 4 assembly guide in description of this video. To disassemble the PS4 you will need two types of screwdriver Torx T8 or T9 and Philips PH0 or PH1. Also tweezer will be useful. On the back side of PS4, where the connection ports are located, remove stickers and below them screws that we need to unscrew. Now unscrew 4 screws and for this we will use T8 Torx screwdriver. Next remove the cover of the PS4 case, start to open the case from the same side. On the back side of cover you can see dust. Use a brush or napkin for cleaning the case from dust. Let's remove the power supply of PS4 game console. First, unscrew 3 screws T8 Torx. Then unscrew 2 screws using PH0 screwdriver. Disconnect 4 wire connector from the power supply. The connector is fixed quite tightly, and if you cannot get it easy as in my case, to disconnect the cable use tweezers. Next, use a plastic tool pull up on the right side, then on the left side. The right side of the power supply will be harder to pull up. If there is a lot of dust inside the power supply, it is better to remove this dust. To do this, unscrew two screws on the power supply and open it for cleaning. Disconnect the Blu-ray drive cable from the PS4 motherboard. To do this, press the tweezers onto the iron plate and pull the cable to the side. Next, unplug optical drive power connector by lifting it up and disconnect the Wi-Fi antenna from the motherboard. Turn over game console and remove the top panel of PS4 case. It's easy to remove, just pull up until clamps open. Remove one screw that fix it hard drive basket and remove the hard drive. Remove two screws securing the top cover of PS4. Grab of top cover near power button, pull up. You will hear it click as you pull up, move to opposite side to top cover PS4 and pull up here as well, after just lifting up cover.
Remove 12 T8 Torx screwdrivers. Now take PH0 screwdriver and screw the last two screws. Connected the fan cable from the motherboard, the cable is turned off by lifting up. Next, remove the top metal panel. Now pay attention to the thermal pads. It is very important not to lose them when removing the panel. Gently lift up motherboard. Also pay attention to the thermal pads and be careful, do not lose them if they fall. Remove all thermal pads from the metal panel and from the CPU of PS4 motherboard. Apply a small amount of the thermal paste to the surface of CPU. To replace thermal paste I use Noctua NTH1. In description I left link where you can buy thermal paste. Next, distribute the thermal paste on the entire surface of CPU. Use plastic or wooden object, not metal. Now move on to cleaning the cooling system from dust. Remove three screws on the metal panel. After lifting up the metal panel, with the brush remove dust from the radiator. Next step is to clean the fan. To do this you need to unscrew two screws. And now the fan can be removed and clean it from dust. Disassembly is finished, now we need to assemble everything is back. For this, watch the video guide on PS4 assembly.